now we're back again with another video guys and take a look at this right here i ended up getting a thousand tokens for completing an agenda and also 2k ended up updating the token market and so we're gonna go shopping we're gonna see exactly if there's some stuff that we do want to buy and obviously if you guys are like me and you want to see the token markets be amazing again then make sure to leave a like right now on the video because i feel like 2k can still make the token market even better so make sure to leave a like right now make sure you're also subscribed to the channel with notifications on and let me know down in the comments right now the last thing that you ended up getting from the token markets maybe you ended up getting a dark matter maybe an invincible maybe a badge pack maybe something else let me know down in the comments and so i ended up getting a thousand tokens right here but i already had two thousand and so two thousand plus one thousand equals three thousand and we got over three thousand of them bro we have so many actually now i'm kind of curious to know how many do you guys have maybe you got over five thousand maybe you got a thousand maybe you got zero maybe you just went shopping let me know how many tokens you have because i'm pretty sure a lot of you guys are probably still saving your tokens or maybe you use them every single day just let me know down below as well and now let's go to take a look at what to get ended up adding to the token market and so here we go they ended up adding oh did they just okay so they ended up adding another set of hall of fame badges they had another set and then they just added another set and I mean, nowadays, everybody has like 60 plus Hall of Fame badges. So 2K, that's what I'm saying, bro. They got to update the token markets and make it amazing again, especially with how easy it is to get tokens. They're basically free. You know, you play True World Online, you play True World Offline. If you play True World Offline, you know how many tokens you can get from there. And also the agenda that I ended up completing for a thousand tokens. Like tokens are pretty easy to get. And that's why I'm saying like 2K, you got to add something better. Like Hall of Fame badges. I mean, these were cool in the beginning of the year, but now it's like, I don't really, I mean, 75 tokens. Actually, is there like a really good one I might want to get? Maybe like glue hands. There's, there's literally a badge to catch the ball in 2K. I just, <laughs> I, I don't know. Sometimes with 2K, I'm like, what's going on? Even though some stuff has been amazing this season, we've had some great agendas, great rewards. But then there's also stuff, especially the token market that just doesn't get any love and I don't get it. And I do want to see what else is over here. They ended up adding, uh, what? There's no way this is real. 20 tokens for one signature series. Oh, nah, this this has to be a troll, right? Th there's no way that's actually a pack. No. We're, we're, what? Okay, any, anyway. Uh, they still have the Champion Warrior Equal Chance Packs, which I never opened. There's like stuff in here, but ain't nobody got time for that. And then what else is over here? And then they have the, the typical stuff, right? Just badges. And then nothing here. And so, okay, so the token market, it got an update. But it's still not good enough in my opinion. So I'll do get make it better. And again, we have over 3,000 tokens. And so we got to buy something. What else can I buy? What are some Galaxy Opals available? Marcus saw we got Eddie. We got Whiteside. We got, uh, okay, nothing there. I got every Pink Diamond, every Diamond, every Emerald, Sapphire, Ruby, Amethyst, and still over 3,000 tokens. And by the way, guys, 2K also ended up releasing a logger code for some guaranteed tokens. And so if you haven't used that logger code, you can definitely use it. It's still available. So if you guys do want to walk away with some free tokens, definitely get it and again let me know how many tokens you got down below in the comments because this logger code right here does give you a hundred and then also you can get some more from the wheels and stuff like that so definitely type in that logger code and now i'm actually i'm thinking wait i just realized that i'm zero for six right now on the dark matters and let's take a look at what we got in here i'm trying to remind myself so there's a bailey I'm not interested in that there's a Dikembe, not really big o okay and then we got ourselves jameson and not too bad and then we got uh, Xavier, who used to be, or is, like a legend in my team. And then we have ourselves, oh, we got the Invincible Dr. J, that's right. They ended up adding an Invincible with this new season. And the thing about Dr. J right here is that I have never seen him online, so he's kind of like a rare card too, and so that's also why I'm kind of thinking if I should, you know, get him, since I don't really see him often, and I kind of do want to try him out, especially with the way that 2K has not been updating the token market, even though they did give us a new update, which is trash. And I hate to say it, but I feel like 2K just doesn't care about the token market, even though it's pretty obvious that they don't. And so, you know, with me, actually, you know what? I'm, I'm gonna do this for science. I'm going to redeem this nice little invincible Dr. J and watch, 2K is gonna update the token market and they're gonna add maybe some dark matters, maybe some more invincibles. Watch, it's gonna happen, because now that I'm using my tokens, it's gotta happen so this is for science and also the card you know looks amazing and it's dr j and so here we go one uh two and a three one thousand tokens and we basically get a free invincible right here man the doctor himself with the fro he can play the two he can play the three and now we get to add him to the collection that's actually my first dark matter that i redeemed this year in the uh, reward market and so that goes to show you 
that, you know, it's okay. You know what to do. And by the way, for those that are wondering, how do you unlock the Dark Matter Reward Market? You do have to get one Galaxy Opal. And so once you end up doing that, it unlocks. So you obviously got to unlock the, uh, you know, Sapphire, Ruby, Amethyst, Diamond, Pink, Diamond, and then the Galaxy Opal, and then just buy one. And then the Dark Matter Market will appear for you. And I do want to take a look at that Dr. J, though, because he might be really good. A few moments later. And so let's take a look at exactly what we're working with right here. Let me know if you guys have gotten Dr. J as well. Maybe you already redeemed him. Maybe you're one of the first people. Maybe you're thinking about it, even though, you know, I mean, I have a bunch of tokens, so I figured why not, you know what I mean? So Dr. J out here, we got the Invincible one, bro. This has to be one of the best looking cards as well in my team and just look at him yeah okay he might be he might be nice actually six six let's see the stats we oh my goodness they're all 99 basically i mean it is an invincible but 98 here and there but basically though everything is a 99 at least the important stuff like the speed the driving dunk lateral quickness oh yeah this invincible he might be okay we might even have to try him out hold on wait a minute 65 hall of fame badges you see what i mean like what's the point of adding hall of fame badges to the token market if every card has like 60 plus you know, like you got end games with 80 Hall of Fame badges. And it just blows my mind how everything gets updated, agendas, challenges, and stuff like that. And yet the token market, they just don't care, bro. And so he basically does have every Hall of Fame badge you can ask for. And we got to take a look. I'm going to have to try him out online, though, because Dr. J, he's usually pretty cheesy. And you never know. He might be worth it. 12 seconds later. And you know what? While we're at it, why not cheese a little bit? You know, we got the doctor. We got some big boys out here with Yao Ming and Taco. And we're going to be cheesy. Bro. I'm going to be dunking on people. And I'm going to be doing everything I can to show you guys how good this Invincible is. And here we go, though, man. Dr. J, bro. You know what I'm about to do. I'm going to go down low because Devin Booger can't guard me. Oh, yeah, oh, my goodness. Why would you jump? Don't jump. <laughs> why would you jump there? That's going to be... Oh, I, actually, I get some XP for doing Dr. J, too. Okay, so this might be... This might be a bigger W than I was expecting. And let's go, though, Doctor. We out here, man. We taking flight now. He's actually, he's moving a lot faster than I was expecting. And let me get that rebound. Thank you. Give it to, oh, he's going to be wide open. Watch. He's going to be wide open. We fading with the Doctor out here. Ba oh! Okay, that was supposed to go in. And I like this matchup right here. What's up, LaMelo? What's up, baby? I got to go for that three. Ah, got you. Oh, my God. Oh, my goodness. Doctor. Oh, Doctor J with that nice little, okay, yo. These moves, though, man. He might be an old school player. But he's playing like, I mean, we are playing my team. So nowadays, my opponent right now is just dribbling like a maniac. Look at him. This guy thinks it's Spark out here. Oh, he got me. Oh, oh, he got me. Oh, look at that. Okay, I didn't even matter at that. That was nice. I'm lagging. Oh, my God. And okay, man, we got a nice little mix of old school and new school out here with Dr. J. What's up, LaMelo? Come on, come on, LaMelo. You know you can't guard me. You know you can't guard me. I'm gone, bro. I'm taking flights. Yo, Dr. J out here is nice. He's definitely going to be a fun card, though. He's nothing too crazy. His release isn't as fast as I thought it was going to be. And I think my opponent, hello? Are you good? Are you good? Okay. Oh, he's pointing at me. Oh, oh, he's a Naruto fan out here. Okay. I respect it. I respect it. And what's up, KD? You know he can't guard me. Oh, we dancing out here too. Dr. J. Oh! Dude, I don't know why he slowed down right there. Like, out of nowhere, he just slowed down. I got a quick... Okay, I was going to get a quick foul. But instead, I'm popping this three from way downtown contested. Bang! Okay, Dr. J, I see you. Yo, his release, though, definitely is not as fast as I was hoping. But then again, I might just be, you know kind of spoiled with the end game cards and i think that's what it is and my opponent is just sitting back here okay and i don't get what he's doing bro he's just out here like i don't even get it man but dr j though wide open again for that three from way downtown bang okay i will say his release is not as fast but it's a w and i kind of want to poster somebody oh he reached why would you reach buddy i'm going all the way baby i'm going all the way dr j with the jam and the w Okay, I will say he's definitely a lot better than I was expecting. Even though I will say, again, his release definitely isn't the fastest. And also for a thousand tokens, I mean, if 2K isn't going to update the token market properly, then I mean, you might as well, you know what I mean? That's what I did, but also I did it for science. So now that I ended up, you know, using a thousand tokens, maybe 2K will be like, okay, finally Carlos used his tokens. And now we're going to update the token market properly. And so hopefully that happens. Again, we did this for science. I wanted to try him out. We had 17 points with Dr. J out here. He was greening. He was dunking. He was doing his thing. And definitely a W card. Basically a free invincible. Because again, we got the 1,000 tokens for an agenda that we completed. And regardless, we already had 2,000 tokens before that. So we had a lot of tokens that I figured with the new token market update they added. They didn't really want that. So I'll take an invincible. And let me know what you guys thought about it, man. Dr. J out here. Let me know if you got him. Let me know what you think about it and this right here is going to be the video guys i'll keep you updated i'm hoping that now that i spend my tokens 2k will update the token market with something even crazier and i'll be sure to keep you guys updated but for now though this will be this video right here guys if you enjoyed it and you want to see more do me one big favor leave a like
like right now subscribe comment down below and if you guys do want to check out some more videos three are popping up on the screen check out the squad builder i did it was crazy also check out the pack opening i did with the new packs it was insane and then check out this other upload and as always thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video